So we're starting off with a little backstory on Gianni Versace. Well, that's cute that his mom taught him everything that he knows about fashion and making clothes. She really didn't rip up his papers like that. I'm really loving this relationship between Gianni and his mom. So now we get a little bit of Andrew's backstory. I see Andrew was the favorite. The biggest see, that's why Andrew the way he is. His dad put all them things in his head. Like you ain't got to work for anything. It'll just come to you. They all cramped up in one room and he got the whole bedroom to himself. That's a mess. The parallels between Andrew and his dad are very striking. I see where Andrew got his lion from. This family is a mess. Andrew's dad is obsessive and abusive. No wonder he got problems. So Andrew's dad was touching him as well? This man is just sick. Andrew in that jumpsuit. <laughs> That dad in trouble now he on a mission he really pushed her like she didn't mean anything andrew really about to get his feelings hurt i don't know why he flew to the philippines for his dad to say nothing to him i'm andrew ain't nothing but a thief he really didn't just bid on it that's very disgusting ah so this is where andrew starts his line wow that episode was just crazy man like now you can really see why Andrew is the way he is, where he gets it from, why his family is so dysfunctional and the lies and everything. It was really great, especially the scene between Andrew and his dad, Darren Chris, and Jean Briones really, really killed that scene. It was amazing. This was also directed by the great, great Matt Bomber, who did an amazing job. It was just beautiful i cannot wait till next week it's the finale i'm so sad it's gonna be over but i'm so ready for it and i hope you guys like subscribe and comment and i will see you guys next week bye